All right, what is going on, guys? Welcome back. We are part two, day 21 of the 90 day challenge. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, we are going to make calls here. We need to kind of step up our game a little bit. Uh, it's been a busy day, it's been a good day, but we need to make more dials. So, I'm doing round two of the live uh, just so we can get some activity going. So, I'm going to share this really quick um, on my Facebook page. If you're not a part of our Facebook group, Mobile Home Park Investing Pros on Facebook. Uh, if you're looking to get into the mobile home park business, you're looking to get into your first deal, you're looking to find your first deal, that is uh, that is where it's at for sure. Uh, basically, if you're new to this, if you're new to the channel, essentially what we do is uh, what I've, I am doing on here is I'm a uh, real estate investor and wholesaler. So essentially I own uh, X acquisitions, which is an real estate acquisition company. Our main focus is finding off market real estate opportunities, primarily mobile home parks right now is the asset class that we're kind of dialed in on. And so what I do what I do is uh that now for there. All right. So what I do is I find off market opportunities, uh, mobile home parks that are off market. We reach, we get in touch directly with the seller and we figure out, okay, do we, we, we see if they want to sell, if they're interested in receiving an offer. And if they are, then what we do is we underwrite the property, see if it's something that we want to buy, if it fits our buy box criteria. And if it doesn't, then we go ahead and put, still we'll put it under contract at a fair, at a, at a, at a good price to then assign it and make some fees to then use that capital to then go buy more parts that fit our buy box. So I kind of came up with the thought process of like, okay, if I want to get into the real estate investing space and I want to build out my business, but you need capital to do it, why wouldn't we just call every park, call every opportunity, call every deal. And if we can, uh, if we want it, then great. If not, not a big deal. We'll look for somebody who does want it and get a fee for that. So, um, this is day 21 of a 90 day challenge. I started this 90 day challenge because I really wanted to, uh, you know, kind of document the process, see how many deals I could do in the next, you know, 90 days. Um, we've got a lot in the pipeline, a lot brewing, and essentially it's just tipping these things over the edge. So, um, you know, we're, we're, we're at the finish line on a couple of deals where we're, we've got a lot of uh, stuff percolating where it's like, Hey, just sign a contract here or do this, that, or there. There's a lot of nuance to this stuff. It's not like a typical, real estate transaction where it's like a 10 day inspection period, 30 day close. A lot of this stuff, you know, you got to get phase ones, you got to get your zoning, permitting, things like that. Make sure those are in order. Check the park infrastructure, well septic, city water sewer, you know, make sure that's all good. So there's a lot of nuance to this. Uh, but that said, because there's so much nuance to it, that means there's, the fees are can be a little bit larger than a typical wholesale real estate deal. Now, um, again, we're, we're, we're investing in the space. So that's why we figured it would make sense to do it. Now, uh, circling back to the 90 day challenge, the reason why I'm doing it is because I really do see value in just documenting the process of building the company out. Um, you know, we really started doing this. I really personally started doing this um, back in November or October. Uh, it's it's kind of when I went full time on it. And we've done rather well. And now it's uh trying to ramp that up and build an actual business out of it. And so really, I just wanted to kind of, sh again, document the processes of doing something like this where, um, you know, for you and for myself. So if you guys, you know, 10 years from now, we're, we're crushing it. It can be like, hey, you know, what did he do to get to that point? You know, we can just literally look back and, and see, hey, he just dialed every day or he did these things and this is what made him successful. So I think that'd be kind of cool, you know, to kind of do and, and build that library of content, uh, f you know, and it's super raw and, and uh, yeah. So, um, and as I'm talking here, I'm kind of just, I'm getting my dialer set up. So I have a dialer and um, I'm just getting through the uh, setting the filters. Right. So what I mean by that is um, it basically won't dial any number that's disconnected, busy, or keeps ringing. It'll just move on to the next number. And the reason I like a dialer system is because I can get through a lot faster. So now that we have this all set up, I got my real estate software on this monitor. I got my dialer on this monitor. 
And it looks like this park was bought last year, so that's going to really be inconvenient. Dang, it's a nice park too. How much? I wonder what they bought it for. Yeah, I like that park. Dang it. Of course, I like that park. It's Tampa. Yeah. I'm going to start getting into those. the right number. Hmm. answer okay that's a lot same owner as this guy
Sorensen Rental. We are not available. Please leave your name, phone number, and a brief message. We'll return the call as soon as possible. If you need immediate assistance, you can try our office cell phone, which is 850-686-2355, and that will accept the text message as well. Thank you and have a good day. Hey, Carla, this is uh, Spencer Davidson uh, touching base uh, again regarding your mobile home parks here uh, in Milton, uh, Florida. Um, just wanted to circle back. I know we had a, had a handful of conversations the past few months. Um, and I know last time I spoke, I believe it was a month ago or so, you mentioned maybe around tax season or April is when you're considering, uh, you know, potentially selling. And so I know we're working through tax season now. We're doing the same. Um, and I know you did have some concerns with our group if if we were just going to try and flip it or, you know, what, uh, you know, wholesale the deal and, and, and uh, you know, talking with my partners, we're, we're interested in buying it and holding it. We have 38 parks currently uh, and, you know, the size of these parks kind of fits what we're looking for. So um, anyways, just wanted to circle back. I, I wasn't sure if you were going to put it on the market or if you were potentially looking to do a do a deal direct to directly with the buyer. Um, and, and, and kind of come up with terms together or how, how you wanted to do that. But I just didn't want to miss out on the opportunity here. So uh, again, I do appreciate uh, the time. If you want to call me back, my cell phone is 850-319-2300, 850-319-2300. Thanks. Bye-bye. Oh, man. That's a bummer. Really, it's all the numbers I got on here? Okay. Calling off my cell phone because my software had some additional numbers that weren't on here, so.
Hello. Yes, hi there. Um, I don't know if I have the right number. I was actually looking for the owner of the Avalon Mobile Home Park here in Tampa. Oh, that's my husband. Oh, sorry about that. I guess I don't. I don't know how I got your yeah. number here. <laughs> I know. Let me give you his number. He's oh. not here right now. Okay, great. It is eight one three. Okay. Seven eight five. All right. Six eight one two. Okay, perfect. I I really appreciate it. And his name is Anthony, right? Sure. Yes. Okay, great. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Sure. Okay, right. bye. Bye-bye. You've reached Tony Umholtz with First Horizon Mortgage. Sorry I'm unavailable to take your call right now. If you need immediate assistance, please call my office at area code 813-603-4255 or leave a detailed message and I'll call you back when I return. Thanks for calling. The mailbox is full and cannot accept any messages at this time. Hey, Tony. Hey, Tony. My name's Spencer. And I was touching base. Reaching out at this time to see if you might be open to receiving an offer slash selling the Avon Mobile Home Park. Here in Tampa. My partners and I own five parks here in Tampa already. And we love the market. I understand you probably get lots of calls, but we are very serious buyers and are actively looking to buy another park in the area this year. Let me know if there's any interest or at what price point you might be looking to sell. Thanks for your time and consideration. All right, we'll shoot that off. Okay. Um, let's see here. Not in touch. Oh, 
up AI on that. Yeah, that Yeah. Hi. Good afternoon. Or good evening. Rather. Sorry about that. Is, are you by chance the owner of the uh, um, the Belmont Mobile Home Park here in Clearwater? Oh. Okay. Great. Uh, my name is Spencer. I was. I was. Actually, I'm with uh, X Acquisitions. I was just touching base. Uh, my group and I. We own a handful of parks in the uh, Tampa, St. Pete area, and we're actively looking to buy another park here in the Clearwater area. Obviously, I know you're probably getting tons of calls, but uh, we're, we're we're serious buyers. We're we're active. We're liquid, and we're just look, trying to reach out. Not a lot on the market, so seeing if you might be open to selling or receiving an offer at this time. Yeah, so we have um, we have park in St. Pete on Fifty Eighth Ave. Um, uh, and then we have uh, we have, but then and then we have five in, in Tampa, and then a couple more in Orlando. I know I know uh, Tampa, Hillsboro, but um, so we just love the area. Obviously, so does everybody, right? Um, <laughs> but but you know we we love. Oh, um, so we're um, we're twenty six hundred fifty eighth. It used to be called Casa de Sol. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. Yep, yep. So absolutely. So uh, yeah, we took that one down, um, you know, and uh, we obviously love that park. Um, and then, and then uh, you know, we're just actively looking to buy more. And, and I'm on the acquisition side, so um, – you know, they, I kind of in the front lines here just to see if there's any interest. And then obviously, you know, the, the partners that, that uh, handle the financing and everything they're, you know, they basically said, Spencer, go find us some opportunities. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs> but uh, anyways. Okay. Nice. Yeah, it looks like maybe 2000, 2002 is when you bought it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, and I understand, you know, again, like I mentioned, you're probably getting lots of calls and, and we're, like I said, we're realistic people. We understand the demand in these markets. So if there is ever an interest or you're, there's one of these that are more of a pain in the rear end than, than the other, we understand that completely. We have, you know, 21 parts in Florida and not all of them always perform the best. So if you have any of those or, or the, you know, again, you just are open to selling. I mean, we understand the demand and we will pay a very fair market value for these markets, you know, and uh, we're, we're legitimate people. So. Yeah, absolutely. Again, I, I appreciate your time. And, and I guess just to, this is some of the conversation. It sounds like right now, not, not that interested, even if there was a, a price point or, or a, a, a kind of a high number, you know, price per pad number you would consider at all, or just not, not at all. Sure. Mm -hmm. 
Right. Right. No, that makes sense. And so all, all are all 11 parks in Pinellas or? Gotcha. Oh, okay. Very good. And then how many pads roughly uh, would that, would that accumulate to? Okay. Well, um, you know, again, I, I appreciate you taking the time. Um, you know, if, if it were ever a situation where you did look, you know, you, like you mentioned, maybe a year or two where the interest rates are better, you know, on, on the buyer side to obviously increase the value of your parts as well as that, you know, the additional hundred dollars a month uh, increase. Um, obviously, again, increases value. And that said, we're, we're, we're pretty serious buyers at this time, um, you know, and, and 470 pads in this area, we would definitely be interested. We have 2000 pads currently. Um, so if you, yeah, I said, and we, we want to get to, we want to get to the 3000 this year. And so a, a buy like this would put us in that, that bucket. And, and we understand the price pricing in these areas and what they're going for. And so, um, I guess the reason I say that is just, I, I don't, I know you get a lot of calls, so I don't want you to think this is just someone else coming, calling from out of state that doesn't understand the market. We understand these, these parks trade anywhere from 60 to hundred a pad, depending on the on the uh, location and obviously utilities and infrastructure. So um, we're not in the rest of the market. So we would be more than happy to look at it seriously if there was a serious conversation on your end and, and thought on your end, if we could maybe come up with something. Sure, of course. Yeah, a ab absolutely. And, and I'm sorry, I didn't catch your first name in the beginning, I apologize. Oh, gotcha. Okay, very good. Well, I appreciate you, Arne. And, um, you know, again, I, I appreciate your time. And uh, my name is Spencer. Uh, feel free and and uh, I'll save your number here and we'll just circle back here and see what we can come up with. Have a good day. Bye. All right. So um, I'm going to end that here. I have a, I forgot I had a Zoom meeting. So, um, you know, it's only a 30 minute session. Maybe I'll hop on afterwards, but I'm going to end that here. Um, great conversation. I ended there with the last person. Hopefully we can get something together. Yeah, that's a huge deal there. But uh, anyways, appreciate you guys watching and we will, uh, we'll connect another time. All right.